Hi, this is Dr. Munyan at Exotic Vet Care, and today Lizzie and I are going to go over how to handle and restrain a bearded dragon. And you'll need this in everyday life to work with your dragon, but also if you're having problems where you have to syringe feed them, give injections, or uh, give some sub-Q fluids. So let's get working. So as you can see, Lizzie's pretty comfortable if we support her from under the belly. And in general, this is a good way to transport them with another hand over the back, make sure they don't run off and do anything silly. Um, yeah, I'm talking to you. Then if Lizzie was being very naughty and didn't want to cooperate with something, So we'll have a thinner towel right here, and we placed Lizzie in the middle of it. Then to prevent her from pushing away or running away or spiking us if she gets upset, we just kind of gently roll up under our beard, making sure we have the front legs wrap around the sides snugly. You can kind of push this foot back in. And now we have pretty good control of Lizzie so that if I need to brush her teeth or open up her mouth, I've got a good handle on her and she's nice and safe and sound. And that's how you restrain a bearded dragon. <laughs>